Today I finally got my package from some stuff uh, or uh, electronic components I uh, ordered by eBay. Um, it's actually, I thought it was from China, but it's sent by Singapore. And it says something like, it's a gift, it's not a real gift. I'm going to open it, see if I finally get my things I wanted to order. It's uh, a bus fuse. And a thermocoupler is for my for my Fluke 179 uh, multimeter. It looks like original Fluke. Okay, I'm going put this apart. My son is going to film this. Um, I tried to order this uh, stuff by eBay. Actually the uh, Fluke uh, thermocoupler it costed me like 9 US dollar and the uh, bus fuse it's this one it costed me like 3 US dollar. I looked on a website in Holland and I had to pay like 5 euro 85 and that's uh, exclusive tax so I actually have to pay like 7 euros and I have also paid have to pay like 5 euro 50 uh, transfer cost or uh, order cost I don't know what, how they call it and for the thermocoupler it was like 35 US or uh, euros and that's also excluding tax so the amount would be like 42 euros something cents 35 cents and also like 5 uh, euro 50 uh, order cost so that's like a, lo a lot of difference if you see this amount or you see the $9.65 and the $9.65 is also with um, transport cost. So I thought let's try to order this stuff in Malaysia. Okay. I'm going to try first the fuse bus because uh, I know the one in my uh, meter it's broken. I can show you because. Uh, the milliampere ampere doesn't function it doesn't give like the correct measuring because I know the fuse is broken oh, let me show it again it has to be DC of course you see it's not working and I go to the other measurements it says like almost 300 milliampere's. So I'm going to open the meter and to uh, change the fuse. Okay, I opened my uh, multimeter and uh, like this one, it works fine. And this one is broken. But I already know that. So I'm going to remove this one. Let's see if this one is correct and working before I. Yeah, it works fine. Okay, this one say bus DMM44 slash 100. And this is DMMB 
44 slash 100 so ampere is like the same I'm going to install this one yep working see if you can put this thing together again without damage it's, it's So let's see if this thing is working again. Okay, again, 300 milliamperes, and let's see if the other one is working again. Seems to work again. Okay, I put the new um, fuse in and it's like on milliamperes on DC and like you can see it's like 230 milliamperes and my other meter also says the same amount almost I can change range almost the same so this is working again so this one yeah it was broke okay I'm going to try this thermo uh, coupler it does measure temperature and it should work on this universal uh, meter also and not sure how I'm going to test this maybe I'm going to try to boil some water and to hang this in and I will show you later okay this is my fluke thermocoupler it's actually something I bought in uh, Malaysia for like uh, nine dollar sixty five cents. I'm going to see if it's working. Um, hmm, this is really accurate. It's almost twenty five degrees inside here. Um, I think when I touch it, it should go to thirty degrees or something. Not bad. I have here like a, a water boiler and I'm going to see if I can put it in the water. 
I hope we don't get any shortage when we put it on. Let's see if the temperature is going up. sure it should reach like 100 degrees when it's boiling it will take uh, like uh, two minutes or something maybe we can pause it and when it's boiling we can set it on again Water is boiling. So I think so, it's really accurate for its price and it seems like working really good. Let me see. Yeah, almost 100 degrees. It's not totally finished, I think so. And it's also possible to switch it back to Kelvin. To Fahrenheit, sorry, not Kelvin. Yeah, I'm really happy with this thing. really fast okay this is my test for today I hope so you can use this maybe you can buy some stuff from eBay too I'm happy I didn't bought it in uh, in Holland because the price was uh, I think so like, like three times as much as uh, where I buy it now. Okay, thank you, and uh, if you like this video, give a thumb up.